Yo, what's up? As I've pointed out numerous times, we have entered into a new era of rapid information sharing. We post a video and people watch it all over the planet. We go live and people watch all over the planet. We need to be on top of this revolution. We need to see YouTube channels that deal effectively with all of the major topics that need to be addressed. So it's a good idea to support YouTube channels that are dealing with topics that you're interested in. I especially like to support channels that are doing something that I can't do. For instance, a few weeks ago, I did two live streams with two ex-Muslims from Somalia. A Muslim husband and wife converted to Christianity, and now they have an apologetics and evangelism channel directed towards Somali Muslims in their own language. So they're doing something that I can't do. Happy to support their work, this video isn't about them, but I'll put links to their channel in the description box in case you didn't see those live streams. A new channel that's doing something that's desperately needed, something that most of us can't do, is Variant Quran. Variant Quran is the channel of Dr. Dan Brubaker, who's a textual critic of Quran manuscripts. He's only posted a few videos so far, but there are so many variants in Quran manuscripts that Dr. Brubaker could make multiple videos per week for the rest of his life and never run out of material. Your average Muslim has been told all his life that there are no differences anywhere in any Quran manuscript. In theory, one picture of one manuscript with one Quran variant should be enough to expose that lie. But widespread lies don't go down without a fight. Therefore, we need a relentless supply of overwhelming evidence to destroy this lie. If we get enough videos of enough Quran variants, we can shatter one of the biggest deceptions in history, the myth of the perfect preservation of the Quran. As we shatter this myth, our Muslim friends will start to realize that they can't trust their scholars and apologists, and hopefully they'll start to critically examine their religion. I'm pointing this out because I saw that Dr. Brubaker now has a Patreon page. I'll say this as someone with an academic background who once had a decision to make. Years ago, I graduated, I got my PhD in philosophy, and there's a pretty natural inclination to focus on your field. But there's also this realization that you can share information way, way faster if you take a non-traditional route. In other words, it's just been ingrained into your thinking that you've graduated and now you're supposed to spend the rest of your life teaching classes and going to conferences. But because of the revolution in information sharing that's going on right now, it's also in your mind that if you want to share something with the world, there are much, much more effective ways to do that now because of technology. So I decided to focus on YouTube. I couldn't have done that if people weren't supporting me, supporting this new way of doing things. If people weren't supporting my work on YouTube, I wouldn't have had much of a choice. I have a family. I would have gone the traditional route. I would have continued posting occasional videos, but most of my time would have been spent teaching classes and grading papers. There's no way I would be putting out hundreds of videos every year. Now we've got a textual critic of Quran manuscripts who's spent years going through manuscripts, taking pictures of manuscripts, documenting textual variants, and he's putting his research on YouTube. If you can, sign up to support him. I would love to see this guy get plenty of support so that he starts to realize, you know, I've got a PhD. I'm supposed to spend the rest of my life teaching classes, but that actually may not be the best use of my time. Maybe I should spend the rest of my life putting pictures of Quran variants on the internet. And I've got so many people supporting me that I can do it all day long. How cool would it be to see more experts on YouTube exposing lies? The links to Dr. Brubaker's channel and Patreon page are in the description box. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Support if you can support. Talk to you tomorrow because Sheikh Yasser Qadi keeps digging himself deeper into the hole he's stuck in. The hole in the narrative.